Alright, I'm back. That's my favorite thing to say. I'm back. Alright, I'm back. That's pretty early in the morning. still dark outside, but I did just wake up. Uh, Alright, so... We're still trying to kill a bunch of machines so we can uh, get some money. I think I killed these two right before I uh, did my thing. getting a lot of shards which is bugging the hell out of me because every time we get them we've got to spend them on upgrading something so let me look I want to see what have I done it's been a few hours so this quest here okay we're still doing gratis quest all right let's just get my head back around it I think this is the last one we're going to do quest that we have to do before we go to uh, uh, do the quest that Ross wants us to do. It'll actually be our first medium machine in the game. We've been hunting small machines and uh, successfully most of the time. And we're going to end up hunting our first medium machine. Oh, and I want to apologize. Uh, the guy that I've been watching a lot of his videos that's giving me a lot of tips is Arctic. Arctic. A-R-T. No, A-R-R. A-R-K. T-I-X. Arctic. And, uh. I've been calling them Matrix, so I gotta apologize for that. Yeah, check out his videos. He's got good tutorial videos. I'm sure he's got good gameplay videos too. Uh, I've only been watching his tutorials. <sighs> but he's a very good speaker. He really impresses me with his tone and attitude on his, uh, when he speaks. The brave trail up the rocks Which is close by. Good as well. What best way to kill these guys is to eye eyeball. Oh, bunny, 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 bunny. Where'd you go, bunny? And I did realize something. Okay, so we're getting about an average of one shard out of these things. But when we loot a downed uh oh there's six when we loot a down watcher cork carcass oh sorry like i said i just woke up i haven't even drank any coffee yet i've got it right beside me i need to start drinking that stuff but um and if you notice every time you go up a level your next level is a thousand more see how it's level eight now we got to go up to eight thousand to get it and your health goes up 10 points. 
So the more health you get, the longer you can stay in battle without getting killed. Ah, shit. I'm better than that. Hey, Lil, you're better than that. I'd be surprised at how far off you can, uh, you can hit these things. And you can shoot through the grass, but sometimes it's like uh, he's running. Uh, and like I said, once you down something, the highlight of the puck is to find it. Save this for later. And meat's good because you need that for a lot of things too, especially if you're gonna make health potions. For those fishies, there's a fishy here, fishy, fishy. Yeah. Now, something that's a little different about this game in Forbidden West is uh, fish don't float, they don't get washed away by the current. And neither do you. Bidden West, the current will be against you. Grata may be devout, but it takes strong arms to reach the Overlook the fast way. Remember, Aloy will do all the work. Now, I did hit the A button to jump there. Okay, you hear that noise? That's what we gotta go investigate. See how she's reaching? Hit the X button. And, uh, X to jump. If you kind of like don't see your little climbing post, you just move the stick around a little bit until you. She'll find it for you. See her reaching? X button to jump. Yeah, if you don't see your climbing stick, you can just push it in a, in a different direction. She's not going to jump off unless you hit the X button. So she'll hang there until, uh, until you tell her different. Now, if we if we repel down this, we're just going to end up down on the next lid. We want to get. We want to jump. Ooh, shit. Oh, that was not good. Bad decision, Sonny. Yeah, that was a fuck up. That was a major fuck up. And you're going to do that sometimes. So you're reaching. Now see, if I don't touch the stick, she'll just hang there. Push up. And then slide her over. Up. I guess I need to quit training or talking and uh, holding uh. okay so you want to jump up and god dang it she didn't catch it again so my timing is way off for some flipping reason and I don't know why I'm going to have to 
get a bunch of uh, compost. Snow. It's not getting any warmer out here. out on this and jump? I don't think you can jump when you're out here. Oh, you can jump when you're out there. That is not bad. Jeez, jeez. These are hard to find. And you're going to need some, uh, dang it. You're going to need some stuff off these. Uh, I got a couple and I gotta find their asses. You're gonna need uh, some major components off of these. God, if I'd have planned that out better and this thought about promising. those geese, I might have been able to uh -huh. kill a half a dozen. Grata's though. prayer beads. I see why she comes up here to pray. It looks out to Mother's Gate. You know, I wonder what bothers me more that she ignores me, or that with all her talking to all mothers, she's never lonely. Okay, so there should be two geese laying down there somewhere. And uh, I'd have to go. I don't want to interact with Ross yet until I finish this. Uh, there's got to be two geese down there somewhere. One of my favorite animations in the game. Repelling. That's just badass. I'm afraid of hikes, so uh, being able to do shit like that is uh, fun to me. Now I'm a pussy when it comes to hikes, I will admit it. Well, I'm not seeing my geese. I killed two, I know. A quick way down. Here's one right next to his butt. So that's a campfire. Huh. Oh, Whatever they're hunting out there, it doesn't sound easy. That looks like a geese. A goose? A goose? Geese is plural. going to talk to Ross because we want to finish this quest. We, we really need more shards. Uh, I really would like to go into the proving with a bunch of shards and ridge wood because uh, we're going to need arrows. Yeah, the, the jumping accident is uh, embarrassing. for machines and I got
a first sip of coffee since I woke up. Yep, they are uh, like, what the hell happened to bro, man? Our brother, he's dead. Yeah, I think I tried to shoot one of them in this mess that somebody would see me. Because they're not totally dumb. And uh, you'll notice sometimes you'll actually put out trip wires and uh, they'll avoid them. Yeah, a lot of times when the watchers cry out like that, they're calling their buddies.
you don't have to sneak up behind them, like if they've got their head in the sand. Never know when I might need these. Now remember on rolling and uh, running and sliding, you, uh, it's all about timing. Yeah, it's one little roast pig. One arrow. There we go, roast boar. What more could you ask for? Huh? Well, like I said, uh, wasted two arrows. But it uh, uh with these lower power bows uh, in the beginning of the game it's gonna be uh three arrows and uh but you use one fire arrow. Fire arrows do use up more resources. That'll help. Where's that other strider at? There he is. See, he's facing us. So, uh, I'm gonna try a slide. They know I'm here now. I was still able to get in on them. That's pretty good. I didn't realize you could still mac them if you had a if they had a red light. That's probably just luck. Got one.
bones and skins you're going to need a lot of. Now, when you save, you can keep moving in the dark for a short, you know, whenever it goes to the darkness, you can just put your stick in the direction you want to go and take off running, or you can sit there and wait. It doesn't, <coughs> I mean, to me, it doesn't matter. Oh, what did I say? Sorry. <coughs> Maybe I should have waited until I had a cup of cups of coffee before I started this. But uh, while I'm drinking my shot of coffee, I really thank you everybody for watching my videos. I really appreciate it. Thank you for all the people who have, have subscribed. And uh, please uh, like, share, and subscribe. Uh, like and, and subscribing is the main thing. But if you like it good enough, share it. And. Uh, you want to contribute to my coffee addiction I have a link that I'm starting to put in all my descriptions but is on my main page uh, all my new videos I should have it in uh, to buy me a cup of coffee it's uh, a way to try to help support my addiction and uh, help support my YouTube channel one of the things uh, early on YouTubers can do. Take a look, take a look, take a look. Yeah, I did that. Come on, come on, get that eyeball out of here. More than equipped to take you on. More than equipped. Odd Grotta did to get uh, put into exile, made an outcast. There's Grotta, all alone with Allmother, the only way she knows. Here are your prayer beads, Grotta. You have what you need. All mother. Each morning I find your tears of joy speckling the leaves. Joy at the beauty of all you have made. See how I cry now with you in gratitude. So you'll cry for her, but she won't speak to me. Fine. Oh. Guess that makes you the better outcast. Grata, I may not be around much for a while. I'm gonna run in the proving, and I'm not sure what's gonna happen after that. Oh, mother, I thank you for the kindnesses you share. When the proving comes, in your great wisdom, may you give favor to a brave of generous heart. I think I get what you're saying. Goodbye, Grata, for now. I told you earlier. Oh, mother. 
Hear me as I count off my years of devotion. She is talking to you when she's talking to all mother. Let me whisper to you. Okay, as so your soothing whisper comes in the hushing of the grass. That's pretty much it. To try to get some all points mother. to level up. See how the before beads we go have been worn to the main one. We have nothing left, and I can't remember any other quest we can pick up until after the proving so we got two skill points so i need one more before i can get heart hoarder i mean there's there's a lot of good stuff in here really is uh, but uh See, that wouldn't be bad. Uh, I really think I want this. I thought maybe I'd wait till later. Because... I don't know if it makes any difference. You know, think about it. If you, if you get a 20% increase when you've only got, you know... 20, does it, if you, if you build up your resources by making the pouches bigger, does it keep the same, you know, do you get more in there because, you know, 20% of 100 is 20, 20% of 200 is 40, so is it going to make a difference if I wait until I get my pouches all the way built up? I don't know. And then we won't start getting more health potions, room for health potions, until we start doing like this one right here, doubles the capacity of your medicine pouch. I don't know, son. I was going to spend these two points. Oh, that's good. Atrix Arctic uses it a lot. Atrix Arctic. I apologize for calling him Atrix. I don't know why I wanted to say that. Arctic. Uh, he uses it a lot, but I just don't have in my mind to jump a lot. But it helps you jump and and slide and bow. Uh, it just helps you if you use your bow. Uh, which you will use your bow a lot. Gives you better time to aim. Uh, I usually don't take that on early because I'm just don't I, I don't remember to do it. Then uh, that's nothing that we really need right now either. But yeah, it's good. Concentration is definitely good. And precision would be good. Speed up healing. Like I said, the only reason I ain't taking this right now is because we're not fighting any real dangerous machines. And I'm, I'm clicking right along as it is. Uh, gather would be good. Yeah. I think I'm going to set weight and get hoarder and then I'll start working on some of this other stuff. The other one I want to unlock is this one here be able to remove the coils without destroying them but that's gonna you know we're gonna have to go here here and then we got to jump over to here to here see how it's linked together same way with this how it's linked you don't go straight down you got to do this little tree you know in uh, in fallout I'm bad about, uh, I'll play the game, and I won't do my leveling up till I have like six, so that I can really pick what I want, when you got a lot of them, you can, you know, a lot of skill points. Ugh, the scrapes. What the hell, I see something over here, what is it? Oh, they're back. 
Like I said, I'd like to get some more shards. Let's see. Let's, uh, let me look at my timer on my video. Okay, we've got 30 minutes. I think I'm going to spend 30 minutes hunting, and then we'll start the, uh, the next quest. Point of the spear. I ain't gonna bash these suckers. Come on, come on, come on. And they hang out there for a long time. <coughs> Sorry. Should've took a Benadryl too. I don't know if I told you, but my oldest dog is not feeling well at all. And I talked to the vet about him and they want me to put him to sleep. And I'm struggling with that. Uh, I mean, he's, he's still... Uh, I don't know. He, he doesn't... He doesn't act like he's in pain. But he's not moving around very well. And, uh, he's... You know, sometimes he's happy. Sometimes he's not happy. He's actually 17 years old. I don't know, man. I feel like if I put him to sleep, I'm killing him. You know, I've had two dogs that died in my lap, and kind of they weren't. Uh, they acted more happy that they were with me. Saving these for the trail. But I don't know. Debbie doesn't want him to suffer, and I'm telling her I don't think he's suffering. Look, I mean, he's getting around. He's still eating. He just. Uh, he's, he's breathing hard. He's having a hard time breathing. And, uh, I don't know. I won't, I won't talk about it anymore. I'm sorry. So that sound right there usually means there's a machine around. I got no idea what that. Oh, we're back. Okay, we can get some more. Uh, it's more junk. All about the junk. I 
I know the machine hunting is kind of repetitive, but it's a thing you got to do if you want to have get anywhere in the game. You got to have better weapons as you progress. But uh, I think it's fun. I think it's enjoyable. I like sneaking around, trying to think up different strategies on how to get them. Whoa. Pretty much a repeat of what I did last time. Oh man! Come on, big boy. Poor little guy, as Halo likes to call him. I don't know if it's true, but I read I read somewhere if you roll, uh, you're harder for them to detect. I don't know if that's true or not. Let's see, if I went after him, that guy there would, uh, would get me. And I could probably get away with killing him now since there's really nobody looking. Low and quiet does it. He might. Now he wouldn't. I'm thinking he's gonna come up over here by me. Yeah, he's gonna walk right in front of me. Gotta have patience, people. getting skittish where they don't even want to investigate. I also think that whatever uh, one, if you got like multiples out there, if, if there's one that's close, you know, I mean, if you're looking straight at them, uh, they'll be the ones to call, but I might be wrong about that.
to meet. Got a half a coffee down. Never mind. Coffee cups are about the twice the size of a regular coffee cup. Well, speaking of Taz, he came in here and laid down. in my slide. Now when you get out of range of those, uh, once you tag them, you got to re-tag them again.
maybe the last one. Fish you don't really have to sneak up on. Yeah, fish and geese. You want to get them uh, every chance you can get. Uh, boars, raccoons, foxes. Probably running into them a lot. The only other one I can think of, I mean, my, my mind's not wrapping around how many different animals there are in the game, but uh, the uh, frozen wilds, when you get there, it, it introduces the, uh, the owls, and you will need owls, parts of owls. Owl feathers, owl uh, skins, all that good stuff. Oh, rats. We're going to need rats, too. Uh, when, when we go back and search that bunker out, I'll kill every rat I see. Surprisingly enough, you know, the rats have what they call tiny meat. And, uh... You need that trading for some stuff. You know, people actually ask you for tiny meat. I mean, all, all of it is used for something. If you get an overabundance of it, you can sell it to a trader.
All right, I let my dogs out. Taz went outside, my sick one. He's out there laying in the grass. Uh, it's supposed to rain here in Oklahoma today. And uh, I don't really need to mow the yard. But after it rains, I guarantee I'll have to mow it. <coughs> oh, okay, we got uh, three minutes on the timer. Let's try to kill these two guys over here real quick. They're barking some. Saturday morning this early? It's probably a deer. Uh, or another dog. People aren't usually out this early on Saturday mornings. <laughs> okay, so we're going to time out here pretty quick. Stand around and look for another minute. See what they're barking at. <sighs> Man, it's all misty outside. Looks good, looks nice. All right, 30 seconds, people. Sorry. Uh, if they would have had this for the GOG version, I would have bought it on the PC, but they don't. And I have the PlayStation, and they cost 10 bucks. What the hell? Remember, I got my game for free when I bought my console, my PS4.